Am I really doing this for some lousy clo- <gasps> There are Zoogles here, too? Hey! Uh. Right. Just a minute. Zoogle shouldn't be a problem, right? I'll give it a shot. This one's mine. Take it. You're finished. Where are you going? You're mine. It's over. Take it. Mega Where are you going? Here I come. You're finished. Here I go. You picked the it's wrong over. fight. Go find someone else to pick. Gone. Flyers. This one's mine. I'll shoot them down. Take this! It's over! Mega Ray! Where are you going? You're mine! You're finished! Sighted! Eat dirt! Mega I never miss! You're mine! You're finished! Mega Ray! Sighted! This one's mine! Eat dirt! Where are you going? Take this! It's over! Mega Ray! Take it! This one's mine! Here I come! It's over! There! One more! Mega Ray! Sighted! I'm only getting started! Where are you going? Take this! It's over! Mega Ray! I prefer it that way. What about you? Just watch and see! Here I come! Take it! You're on! I'm only getting started! You picked the wrong fight! Here I come! Mega Ray! <sighs> this, this could be useful. You can hardly see anything from here. Why don't we climb up higher and see if we can get a better view? So these are the Fagin ruins? How'd you figure a place like this turns derelict? Your guess is as good as mine. I didn't even know this place existed until we heard about it. All that matters to me is whether I can find anything to wear in there. Why does she care so much about her appearance? <sighs> I wonder if those are the Fagin ruins below us. Shouldn't be too much farther now if that's the... I guess it's been a while since I had a bite to eat. Don't worry about me. I'm used to working while I'm hungry. It's no big deal. It is a big deal. You should eat whenever you can. The last thing I need is you keeling over in the middle of a fight just because you didn't eat. Never thought I'd get lectured on eating by a Renan, of all people. Yeah, well, some of us Renans know what it's like to go without food, believe it or not. What do you mean? I thought... This isn't about me. Now, are you going to eat or not? I would, if we had anything to eat. But we don't. <sighs> Actually, I have a little bit of food on me. You've been carrying that stuff around this whole time? I'm not sure it's gonna be enough for the both of us, though. That's why we're going to cook it instead. Cook? I've never done anything like that before. Me neither, to be honest. But we've got to make something out of all this, so might as well try.
What are you staring at me for? Your clothes are all about function over form. All done. Come and eat. You really do eat through that mask of yours, huh? I'm impressed you can manage so well. Huh? Oh, it's nothing. You get used to it after a while. Still, I'm glad we decided to stop and fill our stomachs. I've got a newfound respect for cooking now. But I guess that's easy when you're used to eating everything raw. It would have been perfect if it had any flavor. Sorry it didn't live up to your palate. Oh, no, that wasn't a knock on you. I was just... Sorry, that's not how I should thank you for cooking for me. You've got me curious now. Is it just pain you can't sense, or are your taste buds shot too? Oh, sure, my taste buds work fine. Although, apparently what I like tends to be a little out there. How so? What's so unusual about what you eat? Well, one time I couldn't get enough of these things I picked off a plant, but everyone else said they were way too spicy. Doc thinks maybe I crave spicy food to compensate for the lack of pain I feel. Maybe it's best I take charge of the cooking. You know, just to be on the safe side. I can't guarantee it'll be to your tastes, though. I said I'm sorry. Look, I'll learn to tone down my tastes in the future, so let's just put that slip of the tongue behind us already. Well, off we go. I hate camping out. This must be it. Looks pretty ancient, but I recognize Renan architecture when I see it. It's seen some beatings. If it stayed sealed all this time, it's not because people left it alone. It's not just their technology. The Renans build their structures out of special materials, too. Strong enough to withstand assaults from Danon tools and weaponry, anyway. So how the hell are we... Easy. <sighs> I hate that I can see. Looks like this place used to be a supply base of some sort. It probably even dates back to the Great Conquest of three centuries ago. For an abandoned place, sure is crawling with critters. Kind of makes you wonder how they all got in. Through cracks in the walls, I guess. Maybe it's a good environment for these species to propagate in. An opponent like this should be there, easy. Go! Take this! I'll bring you back Rise from the wiper! Resuscitation! Huh. Rising wiper! Not today! I'll bring you back from Death's Abyss! Resuscitation! Rising wiper! These little ones are hardly worth our time. Less talking, more pummeling. Cut them apart to your heart's content. Here I come! I never fit! Rising Wyvern! Here I come! That's what I like to hear. This Renan technology? I'm amazed you guys can pull something like this off. For us, sites like this are completely normal. This must be... The former owner's old wardrobe, yeah. 
I wonder how long they've hung here. They don't look like they've aged a day. The designs are a little dated, but it'll have to do. Listen, I get it. You care how you look. But we've got places to... What is it? N no, I... Uh, nothing. We've kept Zephyr and the others waiting long enough. We should head back. Okay, let's head back to Ulzebeck. You're in a good mood. Were you that happy to find a new outfit? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm the same as ever. on the ropes. Don't forget to heal your wounds. I feel like somebody's watching us. Crap! Hmm? What? No way! Damn it! Just where do you think you're going? You know where. Moskal. What good is it going to do to- I don't need your permission! Don't hurt the children. What's that? Damn it, I can't reach them in time! Get back, Cole! Duck! Cole! Stop! Not if I can help it! You picked the wrong right. fight! Damn it! Where are you going? You're mine! Swallow blade! Here I come! Right don't give up, do they? Now oh. you'll learn! <laughs> You picked the wrong fight! Are you alright? What about the others? 
Are those bastards still here? Iron Mask, take it easy. It's all right now. <laughs> Most were able to escape, and we've survived. Honestly, we got off lucky. It's often worse when a resistance group pops up. Lucky? You call people getting slaughtered like this lucky? This is how things go when you're a Danon slave. You're dead if you stand up to them. Keep your head down and do as you're told. At least then you have a chance to survive. You only have one life. That's why... I should wait for the right moment? Yes. So someone else dies instead while we live another day. Is that what you're saying, Doc? You're willing to risk everything on the chance that things will get better if we wait long enough. But what's the point of waiting if others have to die so that we can live? What do you think happens when someone tries to resist? It'd be one thing if the rebel died and that was that. But it never ends with only one death. You've seen it for yourself. Everyone suffers for it. Knowing that, are you really going to tell me our waiting has no meaning? But that's... I understand not wanting to throw away the same lives we're trying to protect. That would be senseless. But if you wait too long, if you get too used to waiting, then eventually you lose the will to fight. I don't want that to happen to me. I've already met the Crimson Crows. People who risk their lives to fight the Renan's rule. People who know they might not live to see us win, but fight anyway to give those who come after a better chance. If my life is at risk either way, then I'd rather spend it fighting. So you've decided to take up the sword? Yes, but not just any sword. It's a sword that only I can wield, but one that's also too powerful to use on my own. I doubt those who fought the Renans in the past ever had something like this on their side. That's why I'm willing to bet everything I have on this sword. I know it might mean more people end up in danger, but... Okay. If that's how you feel, then forget what I said. It's clear your time has come, Iron Mask. Currently, you and that sword are the only things capable of driving the Renans back. It's because of you that we're still alive right now. If there's a way through this for all of us, then I'll put my trust in you to find it. Doc, thank you. Now, remember what you said, and don't ever abandon that conviction of yours, all right? Right, I won't. You've grown so much since we first met, and you've met some good people too. Maybe you have a chance after all. Back. Hurry on in. We've been waiting for you. You're not gonna ask what happened? I can tell enough by the way you look right now. I see. Zephyr, I need to ask you something. Would you have invited me to join you, even if I didn't have the Blazing Sword? Of course. Why, though? There are many folks out there who are crazy enough to resist the Renans like we do. So when I find someone with the knack for it, I make sure to keep them close. Plus, you remind me of another guy we lost. Maybe deep down, I'm trying to help you as a way of making amends for what I couldn't do for him. But if you don't want this, just say the word. I'm not going anywhere. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't even be here. If you say so. All right, come on in. Thanks. All right, everyone. It's time. Remember, eyes on the prize. We're after Balsef. Nothing else. Cut off the head, and the snake perishes. Hit them head on, however. And we won't make it through the castle gates, but alone reach Balsef himself. Luckily, we have an ace up our sleeve. We need to do everything in our power to make sure that ace reaches Balsef's jugular. To that end, I'll be splitting us up into separate forces. 
You just said all of us hitting them head on would be useless. Why would we divide ourselves up? Because we're the decoys. We'll buy our ace in the hole the time they need to get in. We only need to cause enough of a ruckus around the castle to distract the enemy. That said, we need to look like the real deal, which is why I'll be tagging along too. You too, Zephyr? So who's going to take on Balsef? The Iron Mask. I'm counting on you and Xion to make your way to wherever Balsef's hiding. Once there, you drive that flaming sword right through him. You aren't seriously sending in just those two, are you? One of them's a Renin. No one said the plan was perfect. By far, the biggest danger is the one you two will be facing. The fate of this quest rests entirely in your hands, which is why you get the final say. You want out? Now's the time to say so. And if we say no? Then you say no. Just means we're back to square one, that's all. And I go back to being a slave. It's your life. No, it isn't. Ball's in your court, soldier. What do you say? I... I want to fight. But for what? What are you fighting for? To free the Danans from the yoke of their abusive oppressors. To no longer die at the whim of another. To break the shackles of our enslavers. To live and taste freedom! Now you're talking. I believe we have our ace in the hole, people. Hold on to that belief, and we just might break through that wall yet. And what about you? I was born ready. Now can we get this show on the road? <laughs> There's a gate on your right once you leave here. Go through it and ride the elevator you'll find. I'll send ahead a few friendly faces to keep watch on your way. If you get into any trouble, look to them for support. We all clear? Good. May this battle herald the end of the Renin's bloody three-century reign. To your battle stations, everyone!